we knew we wanted to be like a hotel style boarding facility. And we're in Wilmington. We thought of Barkington. And we were like the Barkington of Wilmington. It's perfect. Sounds like a hotel. So we chose it. When we first started doing the Barkington, we only opened up with hotel rooms and daycare, of course. And we started really low volume and then it just progressively got bigger. We started our basic boarding, we added grooming, doing our cage-free option now, and it's progressively growing and growing and growing. The Barkington experience for a dog, I would say, it mimics home. Our dogs that board in a hotel room have an 80 square foot room, a twin bed, a real TV, the twin bed is actually memory foam. They are very spoiled here. You get a webcam access to see them at all times. The dogs are completely spoiled like they should be and owners feel completely settled like they should be. It works out for everybody. I love my employees. I mean, as a business owner, it's one just seeing everything done perfectly, like them having the standard that we uphold is beautiful to see. And then just having the relationship with my employees, like allow them to be themselves. They love what they do. They know what they're doing. They would do anything for these dogs. You can have a beautiful facility, but your facility really isn't much without good people. The best part of my UNCW experience, I would say, is the people. I think UNCW prepared me to become an entrepreneur in the way that it just taught me to persevere, keep going. Everybody is so sweet, so nice. The beach is 10 minutes away, and academics are absolutely incredible. UNCW is like no other because it offers great education. The academic part taught me hard work you near the beach. I made sure to teach myself how to surf within the first two weeks I was here. We really have our hands full all the time. A baby, a crew, all the cute fur clients that we have, and our human clients. So Chris and I always have our hands full. 